Welcome back to another year of AFL Cairns TV. My name's Sean Hunter, AFL Cairns Operations Manager, and I'll again be your host for our weekly episodes. 2016 shapes to be another big year of football here in the Cairns region, and we're excited to have the return of Menunda Hawks creating a seven-team senior competition. Whilst in reserve grade for the first time, we'll have eight clubs competing with the inclusion of Pyramid Power. For those out there who don't know the history of Pyramid Power, they're a Gordon Vale based club that was established in 2005 in our junior competition. They've been very successful along the journey winning under 14 and under 16 premierships whilst also being a driving force in our Colts competition. It's also with great excitement that AFL Cairns will again host a premiership fixture here at Kazali Stadium. Kazali's will host our sixth premiership game and our third between these two clubs. The round 17 game between the Western Bulldogs and Gold Coast Suns will take place on Saturday the 16th of July, 7.25 here at Kazali Stadium. Tickets for the round 17 game in July have already gone on sale. Let's now take a look back at the round one senior highlights of last weekend. Round one of the reserves saw the following results. South Cairns kicked 17 goals to defeat Cairns Saints by 100 points. Port Douglas at Kazali's also kicked 17 goals to record a 90 point victory over the returning Menunda Hawks. Out at Holloway's the Lions kicked 11 goals to beat the Tigers 77 to nine. And for the first time in their history, Pyramid Power competed in the reserve grade competition. 
Unfortunately, it wasn't the result they were chasing, being defeated by last year's reserve grade premiers in Central's Trinity Beach by 70 points. Looking ahead at Round 2's fixtures, the first of which will be Menunda Hawks taking on Can Saints at Kazali Stadium on Friday night, 8pm under lights. Both sides will be eager to get their first win in 2016 after the Hawks were defeated by Port Douglas by 84 points and Can Saints suffered a 27 point loss to the Cutters in Round 1. Of the Saturday games, Port Douglas will be taking on South Cairns at home at the Crock Pit and both sides are confident heading into Round 2 after solid victories in Round 1. Port Douglas were victorious by 80 plus points here at Kazali Stadium over Menunda Hawks while we just spoke about the Cutters getting up in the grand final replay by 27 points at Fretwell Park. Traditionally these two sides provide fierce contests and Port Douglas will be looking for redemption after being knocked off in round one of the finals last year by 15 points to the Cutters. The final match of round two will be out at Holloway's Beach Sporting Complex in a battle of the beaches. Cairns City Lions will be hosting Central's Trinity Beach and will be looking to continue their good form of Round 1 after they defeated North Cairns by 97 points. While for Central's Trinity Beach, this will be their first competitive fixture in the senior grade. They had the buy in Round 1, however will be extremely confident after sealing the 4x Gold pre-season cup competition after defeating South Cairns prior to Easter. Also new in 2016 is AFL Cairns website. Over the off season, we were able to develop a new website and we have launched it for the start of the season. For those that haven't seen it, please visit it www.aflcairns.com.au. Also in 2016, AFL Cairns is gonna have a strong focus in social media. Please follow, like, or retweet any of our information as we now are on three platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. We look forward to seeing you at the footy this weekend and hopefully you tune in to more action here on AFL Cairns TV throughout season 2016. AFL Cairns, it's a great game.